Hey, Air from Turbo. I've got a puppy following me. Never touch a puppy's tail. Uh, there's various reasons. This is a show tail. Uh, for one thing, it's expensive. This was a 90 some dollar tail right here. Um, so you don't want to be tugging on a tail and things like that, even though it looks really playful and you, there's not <laughs> Just don't. Uh, other reason is most tails are not show tails. A lot of sh tails are butt plugs. Which basically, if you're pulling on a actual butt plug tail, you, you just tickle someone's prostate or <laughs> suck your finger up their butt. Are there kitties? Well, there absolutely. are kitties. And kitties do come to our moshes and they do play. And I've even seen uh, horses show up at some of the big Oh yeah, we did have some ponies recently. Yeah, we had some ponies. Yeah, and a, a pig one. Yeah. So, um, and there's a rat. <laughs> there's a rat in Seattle too. So, um, whatever works for you. Um, puppy play is not just about puppies, because there's puppies and handlers, and that goes back to the dominant and submissive um, type of thing. Although. Puppies aren't necessarily submissive. There are dominant puppies. There are alpha pups that want to be in control of things. Um, but you know, basically, there's going to be a master and a mit or a mistress, someone that's high. <laughs> with collars, especially with human puppy play, there's a lot of connection to the leather community. Collars have special meaning. That can mean that that person belongs to someone, or that that is you know uh, very. Collars are very significant. Don't touch a collar. Just don't. <laughs> mm -hmm. um.